as they break. Mizuchi back to the tail with Wes Anthony and going for the early lead. Y'all have a nice day in the center. Escamins in the outside. Ella's my love between runners. And now Mizuchi comes right up the rail to go to the front. Mizuchi's come to the lead on the inside. Racing inside the 5 eighths with Y'all Have a Nice Day. And three parts Escamins and under a tight wrap in third. A length away, Ella's My Love. Be very, very quiet behind them. And then second last, Lauderdale. Five or six away, Where's Anthony is last. Escamins and coming three wide on the outside of Y'all Have a Nice Day. Who put the head in front? Mizuchi the rail. One away, Ella's My Love. Be very, very quiet behind them. Lauderdale takes off in the back. A long last. Where's Anthony? In the bold rock is Iska Minzen on the outside, just in front. Down the outside, Ellis, my love, fighting back. Y'all have a nice day. Then Mizuchi down the extreme outside. Be very, very quiet. Is starting to finish on very, very well. Out in front, Iska Minzen. Be very, very quiet down the extreme outside. And Eureka Rosa de Silva trying, but Iska Minzen still in front. Iska Minzen from Be very, very quiet. Eskaminzen holding out to win it. Eskaminzen by a length. Be very, very, very quiet second. There was my love third. And where's Anthony got in for fourth? 110.66. The bold rucker stakes Eskaminzen. The start by O'Brown, three-year-old Colt is by Cold Harbour from Miss Forum, bred by the winning owners, Chakara Farms Corporation. The winning trainer is Carlos Grant, and the winning rider, Luis Contreras. From seven starts, Escaminza now a three-time winner and a stakes winner. In fact, has now won two stakes races. Bold Ruckus just loved the grass here today, or I should say Eskimism loved the grass today in the Bold Ruckus Stakes, and uh, Luis Contreras aboard for the victory, and nice to be joined as well by Mr. Delmas, uh, one of the co-owners here with Jacara Farms, and uh, they've done some great things with the stallion that being uh, Cold guy, Harbor. Let's first of all start off with you, Luis. First of all, the turf, the time looked pretty good. Uh, was it soft out there, or did the turf course really need it, do you think? No, it was. Tr grass was great. It wasn't, so it wasn't soft at all, so I think the kind of rain helped too. Just take us through your trip. Well, I got a perfect trip. Uh, the the filly was very aggressive today with the blinkers on. Last time I I rode this filly and it was kind of spooky between horses. I I did, I, uh, I asked Carlos to do the favor and put blinkers and he wasn't spooky at all. <laughs> nice to have your family with you as well. I know your family comes on a daily basis when you have some big rides and it's always nice to have family support, isn't it? Oh yeah, definitely. I, I love my family, my wife, my kids and. It's a huh? great feeling to stay here with me. All right, yeah, congratulations, like my friend, and a big there. week for you coming up next week, so good luck. All right, thank you so much. Okay, thank let's sneak up. now bring in Brett Delmas, one of the owners with Shakara Farms, and uh, this has been a great story for you guys, a horse that last season had some success. How tempting was it to go to the plate, but you elected to go to this spot instead? Yeah, very tempting, let me tell you. That's where we were, we were uh, targeting him for sure, but we had a few minor setbacks early in the season, which... It's frustrating and disappointing to a certain extent, but I think we have him back on form now. Like Luis mentioned, the uh, the cheaters are on now, and it seemed to have helped. So one step at a time, you know. How concerned were you when we got that rain this morning? Because obviously a lot of these horses have never handled a turf course with some give to it. Yeah, we weren't too sure, absolutely. We were wondering if it was going to be a little too soft. Obviously, they pulled all the other races off the turf, and it seems to have held out. I think the rain stopped just in time, I guess, for us. And uh, it worked out. What can nice, I say? Nice to have some success with the Cold Harbor offsprings as well. Yes, absolutely. More to come. <laughs> oh, all right. We look forward <laughs> to seeing that. Brad, congratulations. This is a horse that was great as a two-year-old, and it looks like you've got things back on track here at the age of three. Thank you very much. Brett Delmas with Shakara Farms. A nice victory by Eskimizen and the Bold Ruckus. $15 even, Eskimizen. And exacta returning 42.70. The trifecta 66.20. The super 283.35. Rolling.